I believe it's been 100 days since Boise Mayor Lauren McLean took office and it's safe to say it's not what she or any of us could have predicted. Our Shira Matsuzawa listened in today as the mayor held a news conference on those first 100 days. Shira joins us with what she had to say and what's in store for the next 100. Shira. Mark, that news conference wrapped up just a couple of hours ago and within her first 100 days, Mayor McLean has already dealt and is currently dealing with a pandemic, as you mentioned. But she says while it's challenged our city, she's incredibly proud of how the Boise community has come together to respond. Now, this is what that news conference looked like in the coming weeks. Mayor McLean says she will be working with the budget teams to determine what's possible, what's most important given where we are today and where we have to be in a year, two years and even four years. Today, today, the mayor also released citizen centered transition reports that focus on what she says is a collective vision of a city for everyone. Those reports hold recommendations for actions. Mayor McLean also gave an update on the search for the new Boise police chief. She says there are now two finalists and they're interviewing with community members. But of course, the pandemic is on top of mind for a lot of people here. And yesterday, the mayor of Los Angeles announced major events will likely be pushed back to 2021. I asked her if we could see that happening here. Given what we know now, I'm optimistic that in the fall, there are events that are planned, we'll be able to move forward. But every day I recognize that something different could occur that makes it so we have to make a different decision. And no cities alike. So New York has you know, their dates, LA announced theirs, Chicago has theirs. So locally here, we've got to talk as a region and with the state about what makes sense. And nothing's off the table. But I'd, I'm not going to make pronouncements until we know that it's time to do that. So here are the top three priorities or to do list items the mayor shared. Prepare a budget that reflects the values that she brought to this office and the needs of our community, creating a climate and innovation proposal that factors into our economic development future and her economic development plan, as well as introduction of housing policies that need to be implemented. Mayor McLean says she will also be holding a telephone town hall on April 20th in place of her regularly scheduled listening sessions. Mark. A hundred days. Sometimes it has to feel like a hundred years, mm -hmm. right? It right. just has just been incredible. Uh, no explanation. And uh, this will be one she's going to remember for the rest of her life. I know Absolutely. we will as well. All right, Shira, thanks.